Imagine you're living on the countryside in a small house or in an apartment. Your city has about 1,000 to 10,000 inhabitants and it is surrounded by beautiful grassland, fields, mountains and a lake. One day a person is approaching you and telling you, I want to build a wind turbine next to your community. What do you think? Do you think, that's great, I want to have this wind turbine because I want to have more renewable energies? Or would you rather think, I'm a little bit concerned, maybe I can hear the wind turbine, or I can see it, or has it no other environmental aspects? What I see in research is that in general there are three groups when such projects are proposed. The first groups are supporters. They are in favor of having these renewable energy projects because they think they are good and they are bringing the society forward. The second group are opponents. They are not so much in favor of the project for various reasons, like for example noise, visibility or other environmental aspects. But the biggest group, they are the people who have not decided yet whether to support or oppose the project. So when the project is proposed, then the aim of the supporters and the opponents is to win the hearts of this undecided people. Basically, they want to win majorities. One of the possibilities to win these majorities is to offer money to the people. But of course, people won't approach you and tell you, I give you money if you accept the project. A very popular measure today is to offer the people to invest in the project, meaning they become co-owner of this wind turbine. So imagine, you've heard about this project, you know about the pros and the cons, and now you have the option to put your money in this project and become a co-owner. Would you then think, that's great, I have the possibility to participate in this project and I'm now even more supporting this project than before. Or would you rather think, they offer me money in exchange that I accept this wind turbine. The situation I've just described to you is the first part of my dissertation. But I'm not only interested in local citizens, I'm also interested in the people who offer this option to invest. So basically the people who initiate the project. So these are the project initiators, the public utilities and of course other citizens that want to have this project. What are their motivation to let people invest in their project? Is it only about acceptance or are there other aspects? And of course most important, does actually the expectations of the people who initiate the project and offer the option meet the needs of the people who are actually then living next to the wind turbine? Is there a match between them or is there probably a wide difference between the expectations? Do you want to know more about my research project? Then just visit mistral-itn.eu